On today's episode of How To XRGB Mini, we are going to take a look at how to use the zoom width, h width, and zoom h position functions of the FrameMeister. The XRGB Mini is an incredibly powerful image processor, but with this power comes some pretty complex menu options. As I've made more and more profile videos, I've learned more and more about what each little setting does, and how changing one setting can affect another. So first things first. If you adjust the Zoom H position function in the Zoom menu, you'll quickly notice the FrameMeister has black bars along the sides, and we can hide parts of the video game picture behind these bars. Now, one of the very first XRGB mini videos I did was for the Sega Genesis. However, as you can see in the video, or have no doubt noticed yourself, there is a single pixel pillar on each side of the picture. The Sega Genesis is somewhat unique in that the border around the game is not black but could be any color the Genesis is currently rendering. It's a quirk of the system, but something we can get rid of. We can navigate to the Visual Set menu and adjust the H width. This will actually scale the black bars, moving them inward or outward. Thus, we can hide the unwanted parts of the picture, like those single pixel columns behind them. Unfortunately, adjusting the H width will cause your TV to temporarily lose sync with the FrameMeister, and sometimes cause the FrameMeister to crash altogether. So, this is what the picture looks like with my original settings. However, by changing the zoom width, H width, and zoom H position, we can correct the error and have a perfectly cropped picture. Next, we are going to look at the Neo Geo CD. Here, we have the opposite problem. We are actually missing detail on the left and right sides of the screen. Again, by taking my original settings and adjusting the zoom width, H width, and zoom H position, we can get those columns of pixels back. Hopefully, these examples have given you a better idea of how to use some of the FrameMeister's more advanced settings and help you achieve a pixel-perfect picture.